my name is Amelia and I am the Behavior Consultant at Advanced Animal Care of Colorado. And today we're going to talk about how to care for a Persian cat. Now a Persian cat looks like this. I don't have a Persian cat, I have Frankie here. Frankie has a coat similar to that of a Persian cat, however his face is not that of a Persian cat, it's like a regular domestic cat. So. Some things about taking care of Persian cats are going to be similar to how I take care of Frankie here. You're going to want to get them used to being groomed regularly. They have long coats, so grooming needs to be part of their lifestyle. You're going to want to brush them, get them used to being brushed with all different kinds of brushes. Combs work the best to get the undercoat, but these slicker brushes are nice to just do a light grooming and make the oils from their skin go through their coat and give them a nice sheen. And it's also a great way to massage them. As you can see, Frankie really likes that. The other thing about Persian cats is that their noses are very flat to their face. Um, therefore, they can tend to have a lot of running, runny eyes, like Frankie does here, um, and also runny noses. So you want to keep their face clean. Many pet stores do carry uh, eye cleaners, face cleaners for your pet. But I think it's just as easy to purchase some saline solution like this stuff. So what you can do is take a cloth such as this and just add a little saline solution to it. You can even warm it up a little bit if you'd like. Warm up the towel or the saline solution. Just make sure it's not too hot. And just gently rub his face until their face is clean and there's no more gunk on their eyes. And that's a nice safe way to clean their face. So again, if you're looking to get a Persian cat as a pet, you're going to get yourself prepared for a lot of grooming. You're going to want to make sure that you get their vaccinations up to date and that you see a veterinarian to avoid any upper respiratory infections. Um, you're going to want to make sure you get your FELV vaccination. Um, because they have such a short nose, it'll be very difficult for them to breathe if they were to get a respiratory infection. Also, be sure to get them used to having their face cleaned. Um, the more you do it as a kitten, the more used to it they'll be as an adult. Again, my name is Amelia. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps.